One of the other ways that we achieve a premium finish for our events is the way in which we rig our televisions. Traditionally, we would have used things like a K stand or a truss tower to put our TVs on. Uh, the problem with them is that they're a little bit industrial for some events and they generally present a bit of a trip hazard, which is very space inefficient in terms of having to cordon them off. So as an alternative to those methods, we've produced what we call our Game Boy plinths. This contains a 55 inch um, LCD LED backlit screen, which is 1920 by 1080. So essentially a standard commercial plasma TV. And it rests inside um, this plinth, which is an 18 mil plyboard box. Like most of our set, it gets completely refurbished every single time it goes out. So we can repaint it any color you want. Our white's very popular, but we can also match a Pantone reference, Farron Ball color, Dulux, whatever paint you want. We can also do vinyl transfer graphics onto all four sides of it. And because it's plyboard, we can drill into it, screw into it, attach shelves. In fact, just recently, this one had a series of headphones attached to the front of it with cable going on the inside. So they're a very, very flexible solution um, for high-end events. What's more, because it's quite a large box, we've got the space inside to install all the control and processing equipment for the screen. What that means is that we don't have any other equipment dotted around the venue, and it also means you can walk around this box and from all four sides, it's very neat and very tidy. All it needs is one power cable going into it. One of our other um, digital signage solutions is um, using plasma TVs in portrait. It's a very, very simple technique, but often when we see screens like this, our brain instantly associates them with being a TV, but when you put them in portrait, all of a sudden they stop looking like a TV even though they still are. Um, so this is really good because it looks more like it would be a printed graphic, but it's not because it's in portrait. The other reason this is good is it uses up a lot less floor space. If you imagine this screen was this way, the screen sticks out into your event space, which stops your guest flow. Whereas like this, it's a much more compact footprint, but it gives you the same real estate for graphics to go on. So it's a much more space efficient solution. One of the other ways that we rig our plasma TVs is using our custom plasma stands. This is actually a um, piece of truss mounted inside a wooden surround with a steel base plate, again covered in wood. And once again, because it's all plyboard, it gets repainted. We can also clad it in graphics, paint it whatever color you want, or we can put vinyl transfers on it. For most high-end environments, this is much more appropriate um, in terms of its styling because it's just a lot more minimal and it doesn't really jump out at you. What we're trying to do is make it all about the TV and not about the way it's standing up. So this is a solution we use a lot for car showrooms, um, show homes, or in retail environments. All the cabling's run internally so that you don't see it, and then it comes out the bottom through a discrete hole. What's more about these stands is that we can attach TVs to both sides of them, and we can also attach TVs in both landscape and portrait mode. That way, from one stand, we're getting the maximum utilization um, in terms of having screens on both sides.